That's what I was about to say. And, you know, even looking at that last steal attempt there, uh, Bill, uh, DeJounte Murray is reaching with his right hand across the body of D'Angelo Russell. And going at Jakob, saves it. He just literally stole the ball away in midair, and Lonnie lays it up and in, and two Timberwolves are limping. Oh, the first couple minutes, you called it early, Bill, just a touch sloppy. And Edwards says, well, I guess I am okay as he comes back and gets that basket. Uh, you know, again, I'd like to see a little bit more pep, a little, uh, little better screens, a little bit more sense of urgency on the offensive end, and really on both ends of the floor. Eight and made three. Yeah. And that goes back to, I guess, Pop was talking about decision-making and learning how to adjust. Right, and, and I believe you brought up the point. Marnie will have more on Nas, not Nas with more on Marnie. That would be interesting, though. <laughs> yeah, what, what does Nas think about Marnie? I would like to know. <laughs> a little jump stop and a, and a six, eight-foot jump shot in the paint area. Here is Beasley, and he cuts the cords as Malik Beasley. Russell out front to Nas Reed, and Reed knocks down the three ball. He's shooting 40% from distance. Nothing but the finest varmints. <laughs> Bits and pieces. DeRozan out of the bird. Gets the bucket for the Spurs. There's the bar. And remember, Russell is just 24 years old. Beasley. And a foul here, and the bucket will count. That we've seen so far this year against our guys. One of the most consistent, I should say. Yeah. Here is DeJounte Murray. <laughs> they were just uh, silly the other night with nine and double figures. Yeah, and then they go to Indiana and get blown out. The throttle gave up 134 yeah. to the Pacers. Go figure. On the offensive end. Murray comes up with it. Looking for help. A little hesitation. Following Vassell. Lays it up and in. And it's a blocking foul against the T-Wolves. He was wide open early on in that possession. The pass should have been there sooner. By the time he got it, his man had already recovered. Pirtle kept it alive. DeRozan trying to finish and does as he takes care of the youngster, McDaniels. Rubio gave up what appeared to be a wide open layup because he had Beasley in the corner. And Rubio brings it across for the Spurs. Derek in just his fourth game of the season. Third straight after missing 14 with the toe injury. Vassell in the paint for two. Smart play there. Right back to Pirtle. Jakob, the 14-footer. And the Spurs close within three. He's got good form on his shot. Good, good rotation. Just a matter of touch and uh, believing in it. Jakob that time. So Rubio coming in behind the back and lay it up and in. It got tricky there. Mills defers to Derek White. And Derek answers with a triple. Because no one's running to the rim anymore. Everybody runs to the three-point line. Speaking of three, the three ball this time from Anthony Edwards. He shoots 33% in his first inning. Averaging better than 13 points a game. White, trouble, gives it off to Vassell. Devin aggressively again and knocks yeah. down the 15-footer. Uh, how about his mid-range game? His, his stop and pop. Patty Mills passes it to Derek. Derek's like, no, I'm not the guy that's open. Devin Vassell in the corner. Unfortunately, Devin doesn't knock that one down, but I like the movement. And Russell hits the bucket. Eubanks getting some run with Aldridge and Gay out of the contest tonight with hip flexor injuries as Rubio answers with that layup. Let Saunders is 33. Wow. Here is Rubio. Oh, we Rookie just gave, him that, we gave wow. him that second opportunity. You had uh, Drew and Devin Vassell were fighting for that rebound. Both guys really had a beat on it, and they knocked it out of each other's hands. Rubio's got a half dozen, and DeRozan is fouled again, and count that baby! Holy coyote! Well, the Spurs are just one of six. That provides the difference in the scoreboard. Patty Mills, deep three! Good day, Mike! As Mills. Patty just lulled the defense to sleep, and he snuck through a little elevator screen and gets himself a wide-open look. Vanderbilt from Rubio at the other end for the two. Murray trying to take it away from Ricky Rubio. Kicks it off to the wing, and the jumper is good. Second-year player out of University of Washington. Eubanks, an and one. Nice setup from Derek White. That's a great pass there from Derek. And there's some other guys that have the ability 
to knock it down at a good rate, but they aren't quite as hungry in that aspect. Right, right. right? They, they need to learn how to get their shots. McDaniels hit that last shot of three for the Timberwolves. This one deflected off of two players, and Lehman wins the race to it, lays it up and in. And Minnesota now with an eight point lead. And White, you see, with four assists already this evening in just six minutes of play. Pop having to juggle the lineup tonight without Rudy Gay and Lamarcus Aldridge available. Murray cans the triple. Shooting 30% from deep. Oh, it's good. If you're going to leave him that open, he's going to take it. Rubio having quite an evening. Stretching and laying it up and in. Had his first career triple double against our guys, so uh, you know you can always fall back on those memories. Eubanks with a left hand hook off the window. Spurs just three of ten from three tonight. Lehman set shot triple. Yes. Uh, 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 Pop needed a timeout there. Ooh. Jake Lehman. <laughs> That was uh, that was set up and it was a great screen by Vando too. Here is Lyles coming away with it White on the drive and scores uh, Derek needs to stay out there Russell had a notion anymore people near the logo you never know and that jumper is good as Malik Beasley 8 of 14 in three-point shooting DeRozan, Jakob, and the Pirtle Jam. There you go, Jakob. Great cut there and a beautiful setup from DeMar. Russell. But once again, Bill, it's like the, uh, the formula right now that teams are trying to use is if our guys score, uh, they immediately inbound the ball. They push it up the floor. Rebound comes off to Reed. Timberwolves again pushing toward the rim. Yeah, see, it was D'Angelo Russell had the ball in the backcourt and fired it up. Jakob comes away with a rebound as he and White trying to get in front of Edwards. Trey Lyles the other way lays it up and in. Smart play there by Trey. A little of their own medicine. Two guys out with hip flexors. We need a third. Uh, let's hope that the young joints prevail. DeRozan. From DeMar DeRozan got in the middle of the paint, sucked in everybody, and Trey Lyles does a nice job moving out the ball. Just unfortunately not able to knock down that shot. Reed another triple. And he connects. Gives it to Trey Lyles. And Pirtle with another dunk. <laughs> Urgency on the offensive end of the floor. They're going to have whatever they want. Well, they're 25th as far as points allowed. They give up 115. Yeah. Yeah. And they only score 106. Six. Patty against Reed got by the tower in the paint the left hand layup and one <laughs> Patty Mills good on ya Tamar DeRozan spins toward the paint Got the jumper Spurs get the opening bucket to start the second half. Hopefully a good sign Edwards This is the three everybody camped underneath the hoop Minnesota gets another shot Beasley doesn't miss on this one oh, And it's a good ball fake there by Beasley after Murray averaging seven boards a game along with five assists and 14 points. And DeJounte. Going to his left, the 12-footer. Murray. Use him for two screens. DeJounte with nine. Okogie steps into a triple. Nothing but the bottom. Josh Okogie. Three-point shooting coming into yeah. tonight. Hits his first on his third attempt. Murray to counter. Yes, sir. DeJounte. He's in double figures now with a dozen. I'd like to see him start heating up here. Russell probing away the high arching shot. When he gets it going, it just makes scoring look like it's effortless. Keldon Johnson had a notion, then goes underneath, and Pirtle gets the easy two. That's unselfish play there from Keldon because he needs to see one fall for him. Pirtle's fifth double figure game of the year. DeRozan's pass knocked away and taken by Beasley. And an easy layup. A nice effort there by Jakob just to challenge the athlete at the rim. DeRozan defers. DeJounte Murray hits another three. Especially those three balls. Spurs three of 13 the first half. Two of three from three to start the second half as Russell counters with the deuce. Another three and Beasley who's thinking why do we only get to play the Spurs three times this season? 
on the drive. Looking back out to Keldon. Four seconds, Johnson. And one. Maybe that'll get KJ going. As Keldon Johnson. Beasley, 9 of 12 now. Lonnie Walker right into Naz Reed. Purtle there to clean it up. And Jakob. Johnson driving, couldn't finish. Spurs hustle back as Rubio always finds the open man, and this time it's Anthony Edwards for the dunk. Gives it up to Edwards. Driving against Lonnie Walker and a terrific acrobatic reverse layup. And Take it away with great hands on the inside. Beasley hits this three. Back to Derek White. Looking at Jakob. Boy, that had oh. to be a perfect yeah. pass. <laughs> Absolutely <you're> right. <laughs> Back to Derek White. Driving, attacking. Johnson. Oh, had the three. Didn't want to pull the trigger. Attacks here and scores. Yeah, I don't mind that right there. And you see how he's able to slash and then. Purtle again there. The sell. 43 seconds to go. Derek White. Transition three. Got a stop in a bucket and finish this quarter off in style. Oh, Russell got an easy one there as he got by Derek. Spurs should get a look though with 24 seconds to go. He cooled off a bit, but I'll tell you what, they have swiped enough balls and blocked enough shot attempts. Inside, Lehman for two. Oh, and that's a uh, that's a smart play from Jaden McDaniels and really commanded the huddle at all times. It's fun to watch. DeRozan gets nifty inside. Spurs first points of the fourth quarter. DeMar was 16. Remember he had 38 up in Minneapolis this season high. Timberwolves trying to win the season series though as Noel drains a triple. Noel got himself a free shot. He's got 10. He's oh. at 13. Threes the Timberwolves have as DeRozan lays in this one. 9.33 remaining. Outside to Trey Lyles. And Trey hits the three. Trey coming in just two of ten, but we know how capable he is. And tonight, Greek Freak gets a triple double, and Milwaukee hit for 21 threes. Yeah, it's crazy. Like that. <laughs> in today's NBA, you need a range finder and a GPS. It's <laughs> right. As Beasley gets his 27th point. And DeMar DeRozan strong to the rack and draws the foul. Inbounds to White. Got it! Oh, mama! Don't look now. Spurs 99-95. The Spurs on a 14-2 run. Here's DeRozan attacking and scoring! Holy Coyote! Timber <laughs> Timberwolves getting a timeout here! And 10 rebounds, another double-double. Off to Mills. Patty in the paint, loops it high, and in! <laughs> and we start all over! 99-99! Minnesota's just taking hard shot after hard shot. Hurdle, great use of the fake, gets hit, and a chance to make it a three-point play and a three-point lead. The Spurs, their first lead of the game. In a 20 to 2 run. Russell got this one to fall to tie it up. No, we saw that in their victory over the Spurs in Minneapolis. Inside, Pirtle again as Murray. Looked like he was going to get the layup. Russell to Naz Reed. White got a piece of that one, I think. Inside, Beasley with a floater for two. Tied at 103. He's got 27 tonight. Six boards, five assists, and has hit all nine of his free throws. Russell gets loose to tie it up again. Well, again, beautiful hesitation move. Oh, boy. And DeRozan and the Spurs get another opportunity. Uh, yeah, three white jerseys around it. They had it. DeRozan, take that! Oh, DeMar DeRozan knocks it down! 